Robert, Mr. Eyebrow, your local real estate agent. Uh, today, I'm going to be talking about the difference between FHA and conventional when purchasing a home. Uh, there's two different options. FHA, uh, FHA loans are backed by the Federal Housing Administration, which allows for lower down payments. Also, with the credit scores requirements being a little bit less than a conventional. Uh, in contrast, conventional loans typically require a higher uh, credit score, but also uh, also require a higher down payment. Uh, the second, uh, mortgage insurance. They both have what is called mortgage insurance or private mortgage insurance. Um, the FHA loans have what's called a MIP mortgage insurance premium, which is where conventional loans may require a private mortgage insurance if the down payment is less than 20%. The difference is with mortgage insurance with FHA, it's for the life of the loan. With a conventional, the PMI is once you reach a 70% loan to value, then that can be removed from your uh, mortgage. Um, the loan limits are also different. FHA has a lower loan, loan limit than conventional has, uh, and conventional has a higher limit, um, which allows borrowers to finance also, you know, higher uh, price properties. Uh, and the interest rates are also a little bit different. Typically for FHA, they're gonna be a little bit lower than a conventional interest rate. It's, it's gonna be a little bit uh, higher. Uh, and lastly, probably uh, the FHA loans are primarily intended for primary residence. Conventional, you can buy a primary residence or an investment property. If you have any other questions on the different types of loans, anything I can help with, please like and subscribe.